Hello Syntax. Thank you for sharing with me your thoughts about painting and the lovely painting you made for that special puppy. I really hope he feels better soon. In your video, you talked about how painting for you feels like a low pressure way of making art. And I am really happy that you found it as a good creative outlet to escape the brain beast when you need it. I really think having a goal like making your family happy is a really good way to release some of the internal pressure of making the perfect art. Just like you, I also always feel like a bit of a perpetual beginner at art. I have a similar feeling in most things I do. I think I have been brought up with the idea that if you are not good at something, you have essentially failed at that thing. You've wasted the time and energy you put into learning the thing in the first place. And if nothing else, you failed at meeting your parents' expectations. I'm getting maybe a bit too introspective here too, but personally, I think it is interesting to reflect on and hear about the ideas that we are brought up with that influence our worldview and self-image without us really noticing it. It took me way too long to realize that there is no way that I can become successful or an expert at everything I try. On top of that, I really find joy in trying new things and starting new projects. I'm so glad that as a kid, the pressure of being good at everything didn't necessarily stop me from starting new hobbies. However, still till this day, I can hear the nagging voice in the back of my head telling me, oh, it's just gonna be one of your failed projects again, whenever I pick up something new. I am lucky to have supportive parents that never explicitly told me that I failed them at any point. However, as a soon-to-be 23-year-old, I think the desire to please my parents is something that might never go away. And deep down, I know that they want an expert pianist daughter, for example, more than a daughter that plays some guitar, is mad singing, a little bit of ukulele, some tunes on the Gucci, and maybe a few songs on the piano. All that is to say, with everything I tried, I've never felt like I'm good enough at anything. And I'm starting to think that that might be okay. I enjoy the process of going from not knowing a skill to being decent enough with it. I'm still trying to be proud of my ability to pick up new things relatively fast and to be grateful for the creative thinking and problem solving skills I got from constantly starting new projects. I know it will take some time to stop reaching for those unrealistic expectations, and it might take me even longer to find and own my identity. But what I do know is, I'm happy learning my new favorite song on the piano and playing it to you. It might not be perfect, but for now, it can be enough. Syntax, I'll see you next week.